Let's have a look. Whatever. Oh, there's this over here. Maybe that's open. Difficult time for those who have lost. While I understand concerns for propriety and the general distressing of the bazaar, I must caution that release is needed. We are suffering not just ongoing civil conflict, pitting brothers against sister, not just outright war, pitting Templar against mage, not just the loss of our most holy and the best of our leaders. We are suffering all three as the sky is wounded for all to see. All we know of our world is threatened, along with all we know of the next. With this most grave notation, I ask that the writs of losses and missing remain. That their citizens will indirectly be allowed to post their griefs of known dead and the names of hopefully living, and with them their criticism for how they have been told or not told. For while I have no doubt we as allegiance will maintain our utmost composure, there must be release, there must be grief, there must be mourning. If not, if we do not allow this simple expression, we risk a greater outburst. Let our people shed their tears in as reserved as manner as means as necessary. In as reserved as means as necessary. The man will be cleared in due course, but this day, this time, we must let this simple expression stand. Read by Captain Albion, Olysian Guards, some of us are. Fair enough. Oh. Will this allow me to go up? Ah, so that's how it works. Intriguing. You know, if it's the same map, you'd expect this to be, like, instantaneous. You're rather instant for a servant, aren't you? You're a mage, not my patron. I've no reason to be polite to you. Your patron is my patron, and he tasked you to accompany me. <laughs> to report should any Templars attack you, not cater to your every whim. Oh, this is down below again. And I am... Um... I'm the completely wrong side, actually. But hey, fortunately, this magical door will allow me to go completely on the other side. So hooray for that. It's pure magic! A season of the four a hour. Apparently this is written on the window. At this window, the thief third will did witness the attempted assault of Lady Castine. He surrendered his chance for escape to catch and hold her assailant, a part of Lord Halewine. Hero of Thief, Fall Bar, and aspiring noble were all censured as per the station and relevant action. Lashing and labor disappeared and ostracized from the social season, respectively. The scandal played out far longer in the theatrically serialized adaption, which reimagined the three as siblings separated at birth. Competing for Lady Castine's hand at her orchestration, the conclusion was a relatively accurate to the original event, save the punishment of the thief and noble being swapped to a comic effect. Generally good reviews received, though some thought the height of latest hair to be unrealistic. Served and torn from a disposal walking tour of the capital by Philium Abad. The scrap parchment is hastily torn from an honored document, stuffed into its red hiding space with a large red sock. And we are to obey well. We meet at three bells to discuss how best to serve the new way. Squad below in a misspelled script. Held go at time, praise and trust. At rust. Taken together, missions reveal a time path and key to a location on the world map. I think there was something over here. Either here or upstairs. I guess I'll find out. No, I swear there was a exclamation point. Mm, let's try. I swear, moments before there was a exclamation mark. Mm, 
maybe not. Um, hi. Hmm. Is this a shop? Uh, I maintain a premises wherein customers of a certain affluence entertain the purchase of my ware. So yes, a uh, shop. Very well. What do you have for sale? I have one item available for purchase. It is far too expensive for it merely to be sold. Okay. You may gaze upon it and dream of the wealth required to possess it, as have lords and kings. And then you may leave and purchase things from shops more aligned with your station. Then how do I stay in business? How do you keep the doors open on a shop with one item? My shop is a destination. Luminaries of every description journey here to see what is denied to them. Some pay tribute in the vain hope I will barter. They do not have the will to pay the price. They require a bargain to justify the spend, to ease their conscience. That would defeat the entirety of the purpose. And... What is it? I can't see it. Tell me what it is. If you have to ask, you are not the one to buy it. I need to know if I can use it. And again, the point is missed. If mere use is your concern, you should go elsewhere. The person who claims this will not be known for using it. They will be known because they paid for it. And what the hell is worth this much? So you sell one very expensive item. And it's worth it? Let me now interrupt the inevitable defense of your thrift. And I'm sure you have treasures, and you will have many more. You could parade them from here to Halam Shiral, but none of that would allow you to say you have purchased this. The item is irrelevant. The price is worth it. I don't see why this is special. Anyone can overprice something. To overprice an item? The item must have a known value already. It is then priced over what it is worth. This... This has only the value I have set. It has never had another. It is not overpriced. It is priced. Well, goodbye then. Mind the flooring. It is not used to feet that have been subjected to soil. Mystery box. So mysterious. 10,000. This is probably a trick of some sort. But you know what? I don't think that it'll take that much to actually earn that much money. So I'll be back. Not just because I'm awfully curious. The folly of General Not Sheraton. 3. But during the times of crisis, there can emerge abilities we do not know we possess. The servant under the greatest arrest stood as Not Sheraton. She stood and she spoke. She stood and she led. She stood and she attacked. And under banners they knew and her voice they did not. The force of a lay brought low the enemy. Now perhaps the servant was more lieutenant than page to her battle-hardened lord. And perhaps the strength of the first dressed too much in retailing. And perhaps the allied were well practiced in the rose. But none questioned that not Sheraton was at the least adequate and at the most inspirational. Well, that's one which I guess. Secluded courtyard. Let's go say hi. Alright. Hey, can you tell me if Red did. <laughs> oh, you're trying to hit me, that's cute. Please stop doing that. Ow! Yeah, eat some lightning. I didn't even drop anything. Pathetic. Indeed. Hey! Did you expend to discover me? It must have weakened the Inquisition immeasurably. I don't know who you are. 
You don't fool me. I'm too important for this to be an accident. My efforts will survive in victories against you elsewhere. Just say what? What is the... Ugh. Squishy one, but you heard me, right? Just say what? Rich tits always try for more than they deserve. Oh. Um... Blah, blah. Obey me. Arrow in my face. So, you followed the notes well enough. Glad to see you're... You're kind of plain, really. All that talk, and then you're just... Person. Um... It's all good, isn't it? The important thing is, you glow. You're the herald thingy. Yes, I am. Why? Sure, why not? I glow. What's going on? No idea. I don't know this idiot from manners. My people just said the Inquisition should look at him. Your people? Elves? <laughs> no. People, people. Name's Sarah. This is cover. Get round it. Put the reinforcements. Don't worry. Someone tipped me their equipment shed. They've got no breaches. This is really weird. So I'm about to be attacked by pantsless raiders. Why didn't you take their weapons? This has got to be the most undignified thing I ever participated in. So now that we've defeated the pantless guards. Friends really came through with that tip. No breaches. <laughs> So, Herald of Andraste, you're a strange one. I'd like to join. Everyone wants to nowadays. Can I get a real introduction? Well, how about we get to know each other first? You know, names and such. One name. No, wait, two. It's... Well, it's like this. I sent you a note to look for hidden stuff by my friends. The friends of Red Jenny. That's me. Huh. Well, I'm one. So is a fence in Montfort, some woman in Kirkwall. There were three in Starkhaven, brothers or something. It's ah, the name, yeah? It lets little people, friends, be part of something while they stick it to nobles they hate. Ah, I figure so or something here, like that. In your face, I'm Sarah. The friends of Red Jenny are sort of out there. I use them to help you. Plus arrows. So, what, you have spies? The Inquisition has spies already. Can you add to these professionals? Here's how it is. You important people are up here, shoving your cods around. Blah, blah, I'll crush you, I'll crush you. Mm -hmm. Ooh, crush you. <clears throat> <clears throat> then you've got cloaks and spy kings, like this tit. Or was he one of the little knives, all serious with his little knife? All those secrets. And what gave him up? Some houseboy who don't know shite, but knows a bad person when he sees one. And that's where you no, operate. I'm not knifey shiv dark, all hidden. But if you don't listen down here too, you risk your breaches. Like those guards? I stole their... Look, do you need people or not? I want to get everything back to normal. Like you. Well, I have some questions before we wish on you up. Can you explain a bit more? I think I got the gist of it, but I'd like to know if I'm on the right track. So who are your friends of Red Jenny? You must know them. Oh, it's not hard to understand if you're not trying to waste your day on it. Someone little always hits someone big. And unless you don't eat, sleep or piss, you're never far from someone little. Doesn't always work out, but a lot of people hated this guy. Someone got a laugh, someone got even, someone got paid. And someone has to have explained to them that free help is good. I'm just curious. You know they say you shouldn't look a gift house in the mouth? That's not always the case. So, the glowing thing. What was what up there? Back there you wanted to know if I glowed. Why? That's what you do, innit? You walked out of somewhere and now you glow. Andraste's herald. Oh, uh, true enough, not, I suppose. It seemed like the easiest way to know it was you. True or not? Well, that's what they say and all. Look, don't get ahead yet. I want to help this... whatever it is. Inquisition. Well, nah, I wouldn't say that. Sounds like a noble cause, if used correctly. Yeah, I wouldn't mind it. Alright, Sarah. I can use you and your friends. Yes! Getting good before you're too big to like. 
That'll keep your breaches where they should be. Plus extra breaches because I have all these. You have merchants who buy that piss, yeah? Got to be worth something. I got merchants who buy everything. Haven. See you there, Herald. This will be grand. Oh, I also figured that I would need another rope besides Varric. Too many breaches. This has been a far out experience. Operation Bees is now available. What the hell did I just sign myself up for? It's up there. I suppose that means we're done here. This has all been a very unique experience. Yes.